And now I can show you what I can buy. I can buy. Hello and welcome to my channel, Boo Snakes and More. Today we're going to be talking about the Xbox 360. So please like this video and subscribe to the channel. And for more videos like this, also watch my other house channel. Any snakes and stuff. My youngest son's channel, Henny's Toys and Games. On my oldest son's channel, Little Chris 10. Now let's dive into the video. After the Xbox 360 store shut down last month, fans of the old gen console are finding ways to keep it alive. It was a sad day on the 29th of July when the Xbox 360 store closed its virtual doors after almost 20 years. As a result, games are no longer available to be purchased for the console, but players can still maintain access to previously purchased titles. Although Microsoft has produced the Xbox One and Xbox Series X slash S console since the Xbox 360 was released, the 360 still remains a key part of our childhoods. That is why modders are finding ways to bring non-invasive mods to the hardware. Although it has been possible to mod the Xbox 360 for many years, a revolutionary new way of doing it has appeared and will make things a whole lot easier. According to Twitter user Game Park Imports, this is the best way to do it. Being able to modify an external SDS and then connect it to your Xbox 360, you can probably flash framework directly from the main storage device rather than USB. Then it's a stone's throw away from homebrew and running software. This is a great way for the casual Xbox 360 owners to join the modders in doing some incredible things with the old piece of hardware. Making something streamlined opens it up to the average consumer who wants to modify their system, they continued. I always love when a breakthrough like this happens. It's like when people discovered they could mod load the Wii using an SD card with no hardware changes. With proof that this technology does actually work, it won't be long before the Xbox 360 gets its well-deserved comeback. Xbox fans obsessed with first look at next-gen hardware. Although the next X Xbox console has yet, not yet, been announced, fans have been speculating as to how it can improve on the Xbox Series X slash S. Released in November 2020, the Xbox Series X and its sister console, the Xbox Series S, are quite powerful consoles in their own right, and a big step up from the previous Xbox One. However, with the concert quickly approaching its fourth anniversary, fans have started wondering about the future of the Microsoft hardware. With Sony working on the PlayStation 5 Pro, and even rumors of the PlayStation 6 not being far away, that must mean that Xbox is firing suit, right? One thing that Xbox users would like to see with a next-gen console is a Saberline controller which was leaked earlier this year. With no official confirmation if this controller being in the work of this controller being in the works, we can assume it was just a concept. However, fans would love to see this brand new Xbox controller come to fruition. Hopefully Xbox doesn't fully abandon Speaking this controller Xbox and they plan controller. on still making it for the Did next you make console. A video At the very on... last, one user at least one user said over uh, on R slash Xbox. And Wolverine controllers? No. For the Xbox, which is the limited edition one time. Claiming it is the world's best controller. The Sable promised sustainability approach, ability, immersion, and quick ability. It would feature a rechargeable and swappable battery, new modular thumbsticks. Improved longevity, quieter buttons and thumbsticks, precision hypernotic feedback, and it would even be made 
with recyclable materials and less resin. The Saber controller would also connect to the Xbox Wireless 2 Direct Cloud and Bluetooth 5.2 to allow the user to play anywhere. Complete with a stunning black and white paint job, this controller would be a big step up from the current, but with no news of it from Xbox, it remains to be seen if and when it will be released. Thank you for watching this video and peace out till the I'm next one. Me a story here, just so you know, and then I'll show you the video.